Yesterday, eight families had to be told that their loved one had been shot in the line of duty. It was news they hoped would never come. Tragically, four of those families have made the ultimate sacrifice. Yesterday, North Carolina and this country lost four heroes and saw four other heroes wounded. Charlotte isn't going to be the last place that this happens, but Charlotte will be the place that will heal, that will heal with dignity and respect for everyone. And we're still kind of sorting through that right now. There's, we're not ruling out the possibility that someone else was firing as well, uh, but we're also not ruling out the possibility that uh, as we go through body-worn camera footage and as we go through interviews, uh, to make sure that all of that timeline matches up. So once we are able to determine that, then we'll determine uh, if we do need to look at other individuals or individual who might have been shooting.